Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Hello, 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 hello. It's good to see everybody here today. So, welcome to a brand new ATS live stream here coming at you straight from LA, LA down into Mexico today. So, I'm super duper excited about this. So, I've been looking, I've been combing over a bunch of stuff here the past couple of uh, just really the past couple of weeks. I've been trying to find a good something, something or another that. I can stream uh, with ATS. That's something that's brand new. So I went to my man, my man Paulie, and he put out a brand new skin for the Viper 389. Everybody's like, oh, you got to drive. You do the Viper, do the Viper next, do the Viper, do the Viper. So here it is. Guys, the Viper, we've actually got a custom interior as well. Uh, I'm not sure if that's part of the skin, but I think it is. And I also downloaded and I found kind of buried in all of the 1.28, uh, a 1.28 to 1.29 to 1.30 uh, I was able to find this heavy haul chassis so you can see it puts uh, puts a quad axle in the back which is insane so we've got caterpillar everything today caterpillar garages we've got caterpillar uh, we've got the truck we've got the skin and we've also got all of the DLC trailers is going to be cat and I think all of our mods on top of the, the heavy hauls will be their respectable name what they're supposed to be I, I can't remember if I put that on the end so anyway, that's what's on the uh, that's on the on the docket today. So I hope you guys are ready for good. I've got custom sounds in. We've got custom interior. As you can see, we've got custom wheels on. We've got custom exhaust stacks. There is nothing literally about this truck. <laughs> nothing is a part of stock ATS, which I like it that way. Uh, so you just, we got LED bars underneath the lights. This is an absolute fantastic. Uh, and then I'm gonna tell you what, man. Once the uh, once the lights go off, man, it's a disco party up in here. Uh, it's a lot of lights. It's a lot of damage right there, guys. A lot of damage. Uh, all right, let's throw some. Uh, let's throw some. Uh, wait a minute. You know what? I can't do this without. Let's. let's uh, it may mute up just a little bit here. Uh, just real quick here. Let's throw some shout outs here. Uh, it's Nick T. Obeyed Boss. Good to see you guys. Dennis Fox. And who else? Uh, Steven Skipworth. What's up, man? How are you, Dark? What's going on? Hope you're doing well. Bert, how are you there? Chandler and Dark Sun. Zach, good to see you guys as well. Noble Force. Hello, hello, hello. Un, uh, Hunter uh, Oliver. What's up? Dylan Stone. Bob. We got Tyler Seston in here. Gamer Android. Good to see you guys uh, as well. There's Ms. 3 p.m. How are you there? 3 p.m. Uh, there's Steven again. Hey, look at there, man. Contact him. Bingo, bango, bongo coming in. Uh, top notch there with a big ten dollar super chat. So thank you there, contact Tim, man. It's awesome to see you, man. Uh, it's it's always good to see uh, ATS guys come back around. Blue type, what's up, man? J Paul, good to see you as well. Uh, make sure I didn't skip anybody. The Dax, what's up, man? How are you, Dennis Fox? Jordan Theo, what's up? Finally back. We're good to see, you, man. Kenneth Michael, uh, as well. Good to see you. And the Dragon Spirit, what's up, man? Hey, Rubies, what's up, bro? Fist Cookie Monster, Bud Riley, what's up? J Paul, I think got you there. Jason Fair, hello, hello, Bud, Bud, what's up, man? Bud Riley, Keith, Bud Riley again, Dennis Fox, Dilly Dilly, what's going on? Wet Wheelies, no, no, we won't go that far, man. What's up there, Adam Schultz? Good to see you, man. All right, let's go back into ATS. All right, I'm excited. Let's uh, roll in here. Oh, special shout out to all these guys here that make this, uh, really make this channel go around, make the world go around here. Uh, with me and uh, really keep uh, keep keep up the content. So thanks to those guys and also latest donations down there. I've got that finally up there. So now Content Team, you are finally part of our latest donation guy there down there. And uh, also top donations there, all times uh, donations to the channel. So big ones there, big, big, big shout outs there to Andrew James. He goes above and beyond any call of uh, duty that this channel will ever see. Uh, and also thanks to our new subscribers there over the past. So we've had uh, a few come in here as well, especially over the, the last X plane. So it's good to see everybody. 12 hour whistle, man, but we're definitely going to go to uh, go to Mexico. By the way, um, if we at some point, if we're able to do chat like I did with X plane, uh, would you guys like for me to do the chat the way we did it in X plane? If you have not seen that, and I'm not saying this just to get you to go see the movie, you can even thumb through it for all I care. I uh, just want to see, go over to my latest, uh, my latest, uh, eight, uh, not ATS, man, just go to my latest X-Plane, which is uh, the one where we went from CYYZ down to JFK. Uh, go check out the chat, the way I've kind of got it nestled and tucked up under there. Uh, it's very uh, evasive, it's kind of out of the way, but it, it at least keeps chat up on screen, so if you ever want to catch up and watch on these later, uh, you certainly can. Uh, and it also displays the names, your icons, everything, so it's actually kind of cool. 
Um, but let me know. Go check that out. I, I will put that in each one of my videos, uh, live streams here. Just to keep that going on. So, uh, what's up there, Maurice? How are you, man? What's up? BNSF lover. What's up, man? Hope you are doing well. <laughs> so we get when we get there. You go, man. Nice heavy haul. Absolutely there, Maurice. And what is up, Mr. David Wheeler? All right, let's take a peek on the inside of this bad boy. Ah. <laughs> Pretty good. I, you always see this thing in this, uh, you know, crazy, uh, you know, I almost say non-custom, but it's uh, usually got the wood grain, so we've got all the color actually matches. Uh, so it kind of looks like a newish slash custom cat 389. So uh, everything's animated on the dash now. <sighs> Boy, it puts the puts the hair on the chest right there, guys. I tell you. Oh, and by the way, uh, oh thank you there, Kenneth. Appreciate it, man. Um, so I have figured out. <laughs> Big Bird approved color. There you go, Dennis. <laughs> I have figured out how to float gears. Now, I can float gears going down, or, or I guess you would call them uh, upshifting. Uh, shifting up. Is that right? Shifting up. But I cannot do them quite yet coming back down to down shifting through the gears. So I'm still pushing clutch in for those, but I'm going to try my best to float all of our gears uh, going forward. Uh, and we'll see what we uh, what we should, what we come up with. You guys are always asking about that, so I don't even know if there's really a way to like you know highlight my feet down here. I don't know if you guys want to see my feet. Probably not. It's kind of kind of weird. Probably need to be in another stream for that. Um, all right. All right. Good. Good. I am. Uh, uh, I, well, yeah. I know how to drive sticks. Of course. What's up there, Paxton? Hunter Osborne, what's up, man? All right, let's uh, let's get on that here now. I've already got our. Uh, I'll tell you what, let's do this real quick. I always forget about this sometimes. Um, so here's what we got. So we've got all of our Mexico stuff is back on now. We're waiting for this big update. Now that New Mexico is live, uh, they should be bringing out uh, this one uh, soon. Uh, so they'll join this up into Las Cruces. The I believe it, Cruces. I believe is where we go. So uh, anywhere up the San Simon and Las Cruces, they'll uh, connect roads and bring things back and connect them into the bottom. So I have almost most of at least this this Upper Mexico um, area here, which is nice. But today, what we're going to work on doing is coming all the way down here. Now I've got a brand new mod in for Cabo San Lucas. Uh, so all this down around La Paz, Puerto uh, San Carlos, I've got that La Paz and Cabo San Lucas is all kind of a brand new scaled map down there. Um, so I'm, I haven't even been down there. As you can see, we haven't even uh, driven on any of the roads yet. So we're going to start up here in Cali. Uh, we're in LA right now. We're going to pick up a heavy haul here in Carlsbad and continue on south. It really shouldn't take us long to get down there. Um, if we make it there, uh, usually our cutoff is two hours, but if we don't make it there, then we'll stop somewhere and uh, we'll pick it up on our next stream. Uh, so we'll still be in the cat. So it's awesome. Uh, good say, what's up there, Jimmy the Wrench? Good see you, man. Oh, because of the wind. Oh, it sucks, man. Nice socks. You, can you see my socks? They're, they're just black. <laughs> they're just black. <laughs> Come to see her for a little flirt. All right, so let's uh, let's get this thing going. <laughs> hey, what's up there, Overweight Gaming? How are you, man? Two eight one three three zero eight zero zero four. Back then. All right, let's see. Let's see if we can get up here and uh, let's get on the. What mod is that on the map? Uh. You'll have to let me know what you mean on the map. I'm not sure what you mean by on the map. Let's uh, let's go ahead and hide that. We don't really need that. There we go. That way we get it done. So where do I get my mods, Adam says. Uh, so my mods come from really, uh, there's one place uh, that I really will get them from. Um, and I'll have to look for you. Hang on. All right, so we have pushed the clutch in yet. Yeah, <laughs> I'm kind of kind of excited about. It. I still can't go up. Yeah, see, I, I can't do it. I wind up screwing it up every single time. It's weird because you got to let off, you got to hit your engine brake, and then you got to rev it up, and then you've got to like get it into gear. It's it's a lot. Oh wait a minute. Whoops. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Woo! Hi right, there, Paxton. Have a good one, bud. Yeah, sure is a shiny truck. Absolutely. So we got a couple of new graphics mods in. We took away, uh, we took away our main one, 
which was our uh, realistic graphics mod. So I did take that out in in uh, for another one. So this other one really ups the reflection level, as you can see. Um, so I've got a much bigger reflection level. All the chrome's a lot shinier. Um, all the brights are a lot more brighter. It's not. It's a little desaturated, but the contrast is really bumped up. So it gives it a really nice, crisp, clear. Uh, clean shot on it. Now, I, I kind of like the clouds out of the other ones. People always kind of ask me, you know, well, what mods really do you, do you really like keeping around? I love weather mods that really uh, produce nice sky colors. I think that's the prettiest part uh, of ATS, but uh, this one still kind of leaves all that a little bit bland, so. Yeah, I, yeah, Mar Maurice, I'm, I'm with you on that, man. Hey, what's up, Chuck? Good to see you, man. <laughs> Asian food takeout. Of course, Jimmy. Of course. Looking to expand. Okay, Adam, I, I would say um, you know, the, there, there's really only two routes to go from where you're at. Um, so, you know, for those watching later, Adam asked, you know, hey, I'm, I'm looking to expand the map since we only have four states in here. Uh, I totally agree with that sentiment there. That's what happened to me. Um, so the one thing about it, I guess, that if you want to look at it is go back to uh, ATS Mods. I believe it's dot, oh, shoot, I think it's dot com. There's dot LT is another good one. Or .it, no, it's LT. I'm gonna have to find it. it. I don't know, Nick. If you're in here, I know you know where I get my ATS mods. If you can post that link up, man, I I can't remember. I don't want to tell him wrong. There's a couple of them that are better than others. So anyway, I get them from there. I search through their maps. I search through trucks. Uh, the main thing is you just have to manually install those. You're not gonna find any maps. You'll find the uh, the coast to coast. You'll find the Canada map, and then you'll find the Mexico map. And all three, uh, all three of those uh, can work together if you want them want them to. They're not uh, they're not independent. They all will work. They're all meant to really kind of go one and on. So you can have the entire continent. Although some people like coast to coast, and then some people hate it. I personally don't like coast to coast. Uh, I'll just keep the four states we've got and then keep uh, Mexico because that's my favorites. There you go, atsmods.lt. There you go, thanks, Nick. What's up there, Cody? How are you, man? Hey, what's up there, Walter? Let me uh, let me get this one outside shot here in a minute. You guys can't see this enormous uh, heavy all chassis we got running on this thing. <laughs> hey, what's up there, Mel? And how are you, man? <laughs> Look at this sucker. I would second that Walter now I know what they originally said was that they were going to look at bringing um, they were looking at bringing was it Colorado in Utah or something so I don't know if that's the southern end but I would I would be with you man I'm, I think I'm going towards uh, I'd be leaning towards that as well I think Oregon's probably gonna be the next day which hopefully it's good hopefully it's good hey what's up Wilson how are you man Chris what's up FSX actually now, FSX doesn't look quite this good uh, there, Chris. So, yeah, we'll need to, we'll need to derate the stream a little bit there. Like your takeoff. <laughs> oh, what's up, man? <laughs> How are you, fit dude? <laughs> what's up, Zach? How are you, man? That <laughs> Jacob, it's a feeling 18 wheeler. Yeah, the tire change, I'm sure, would be uh, a nice, hefty, uh, hefty cost there. But we gotta go one more. Going to San Diego. All right, so we're gonna float here. We get up to 2,000, and then right before 1,500, we'll go ahead and get it into gear. We, we might do that on uh we'll, we might do that a beta once we get our uh, our scraper we might pretend that the uh el chapo's uh gang is after us there in mexico what's up there devin owens how are you man mark spence long time no see good to see you bud man it's good to see you hey what's up there chris jacob says shout me out everybody shout him out 
How do instead trucks own ATS? How do instead, um, hmm. Zach, I see your, see the last part of your question there. You may want to put that back in there because I missed it if it was. How fast are we going? Uh, we are going uh, 80 and a 55. That's pretty unrealistic, right? Hey, what's up, Block? How are you? Hey, Stevenson, man. It's good to see you guys. <laughs> yeah, I don't even need to have a... Uh, that's a good one, man. I need to remember that. I don't, I don't even need the trailer to be, be considered a uh, an 18-wheeler. We've got that in the bag already. <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Uh oh. <laughs> we got a little close to the retaining wall there and it took us out turn four. Woo! Hey, what's up, Dave? How are you, man? <laughs> Hope we're going to need to get over. Lucky it didn't, uh, it didn't completely total us out. That's okay. Y'all let you have your Swift TGs on that one. That would have been good, though, if we'd have rocked around there. Y'all would have called me a ball set for that, but it's like, no, nah, no. Nah. Of course not. Of course I had to hit a rail. Yeah, y'all won't, y'all won't give me this, y'all give me the Swift TG comments for the rest of the evening. <laughs> How nice there, Jacob. <laughs> Yeah, there you go, sponsors. Appreciate that. We're gonna, have, uh, we're gonna have to take that. Uh, yeah. Well, you know what? There, there's the respectful, um, you know, sponsor there. 3 p.m. Plug in to FTG, and then, and then there's Dark. He's like, yeah, you're pulling an FTG. We're not plugging today. We're pulling FTGs. <laughs> oh man. Oh, thank you there, uh, Zach. Appreciate that. Yeah. So we got the G29. Just to let you know. We got the G29 and we got the regular Logitech shifter, but we've got the uh, uh, we've got A plus B software is our shifter company that uh, they're out of Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, and they've uh, they did the SKRS shifters, basically what it is. So you got all your uh, you got your your switch, uh, your flip between uh, you got one through four, low and high, and then you've after that you've got uh, five through eight on the backside. So I guess um, yeah, I'll show that here in a minute go ahead and get up here and uh you know, pick our load up hey what's up there contact well if you if you want to do sponsorship stuff uh it's usually it's five dollars a month i say usually like it changes it's five bucks a month and what you have to do it through um through youtube gaming on the pc i think the youtube gaming app will let you do it i'm not i'm not entirely sure i should know that but i don't and i don't know maybe if one of our other sponsors has actually looked at that and knows uh let me know but there's a big green button somewhere on there that says sponsor. When you click that, it'll get your info just like a super chat. And then it is a reoccurring, uh, reoccurring. So if any guys want to do that and want to sponsor a stream here for $5 a month, please feel free to, uh, although it is never required. Uh, just make sure if you do want to cut that off at the end of the month, make sure that you do that on your own. I cannot stop that for you. That's something you have to do. So just want to throw that out there so everyone, everyone's on the up and up. All right, so here we go. Here's our uh, cat scraper. I haven't taken one of these out in a while. I, I enjoy uh, I enjoy these heavy hauls every now and again. So, hey, what's up there, Brian Oma? Good to see you, man. <laughs> well, you're good. What's my damage? What is my damage? Oh, nothing. I guess I just called it. I, well, that's weird that I don't have any. That's very weird. I'll take it though. I'm, I'm not complaining. Hey, what's up there, Peter? Yes, sir, sir it is. Mike S. Oh, yeah, had to do on PC. Yeah, that's what I thought. So, Movie Master, what's up, man? Good to see you guys. Yeah, Daquan, uh, shout out, question marks. All you got to do, man, just, 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 just to plug in conversation. I usually try to read everybody's stuff on here. Um, so, you know, just, hey, just, just hang out with us, man. Start joining the conversation wherever we're at, and uh, I'll, you know, I'll recognize you, man. Not a big deal, man. Not a big deal. 
we try to do as much as I can while I'm driving here to catch everybody that I possibly can. So that's just uh, it's one of the things that separates this channel out. So join in, as we say. Little uh, plug it in is what usually used to be my uh, my catchphrase there. So what's up there, Collie Race? It's Chris Justice, man. All these uh, all my ATS boys come back. You know, like yay, he's back on the playground again. Woo! There you go, Dylan and Mason Gaming. One, two, three. Good to see you guys. So thanks you for your uh, subscription. Rasta, what's up, man? Caterpillar, absolutely. Yeah, I don't have God mode on. All right, so let's get a look at the whole entire shebang as we uh, pull out of here. <laughs> That'll deserve a screenshot right there. There we go. There we go. All right, wait, 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 wait. There we go. <laughs> yeah, let's make sure we... <laughs> Oh, well, no problem there, Daquan. Uh, well, welcome to the channel, man. Hope you enjoyed. Hang around with us for a bit. It's a great, 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 great group of guys here in chat. I love I love my ATS fam, man. Uh, we always get a, a different set of guys no matter what game we're playing. So ATS always brings out a lot of guys I haven't seen. So uh, if I seem a little excited, then that's why. It's good to see you guys. So thanks for coming out and hanging out with us here for a little while while we are uh, going to be on our way down to Mexico. So we'll get up here in the turn. We'll take us, uh, maybe we'll do a screenshot right here. Let's see. You know, it said selfie time. That, that's kind of an FTG thing. So we may change our, uh, now that we've actually got a, a nice load here, we may go ahead and change our uh, screenshot. Ooh, that's going to be a good one too. Man, look at that. <laughs> that looks good. I, I don't care who you are. That That's good right there. All right. That's it. I'm done. Uh, people, uh, people are asking, so, um, the engine sounds, the engine mods, I believe that I have in here, they all come from, um, they all come from, the engines themselves, hey, there's a new sponsor in the house, Mr. Contact, Tim, it's awesome, man, awesome, Tim, I'll tell you what engine sounds we're using here in a minute, so, uh, thank you there for that, Mr. Contact. I don't know if it's gonna. I actually think my my cam may be right over you. Wait for it to come through here. Come on now, there. Oh, okay. So it's behind that gummit. All right, I'll just change that. It's behind my uh, my wheel cam there. Well, thank you there, contact. Yeah, appreciate that, bud. So, uh, so here we go. So I guess on this one, the engines themselves are all part of this particular truck. Um, I don't have any externals except I have one that's, uh, I think it's the, gosh, I'd have to, I can tell you what the picture of it is. Um, shoot. Um, gosh, what is it? It's the one, it's a 2.6, so it's an engine sound pack uh, 2.6. You'll have to download it, it's not in the workshop. Uh, but it's got a guy in a blue suit like a bus driver with a seatbelt across his chest. I cannot remember the one. If you see the picture, that's what it is. If you're looking for like sound packs, engine packs, it'll be 2.6. It's got uh, it's got Packard, it's got Caterpillar engines, uh, and what's the other one? I believe it's got Cummings engines and sounds to go with them. And they're different than anything else. Aside from this, the only other sound stuff that I'm using um, is like a... Um, the only other sound stuff that I'm using is like a, uh, uh, it's the sound fix file. So it gives you a lot of ambient sounds. It gives you the wheel sounds. It gives you the air sounds, seat belts, the fuel sounds are different. Um, and I believe you can find that one uh, on the workshop. I believe that one is. I keep that one there because it updates all the time. Um, so right now, Zach, I've only got one. Um, only got one. So I would like to eventually have three. Uh, and then do one like a, you know, like a USB to DVI, kind of like a, a, a chat on top or something like that. Um, but for right now, this is what I've got. I just don't have enough space on the sides of my desk here where I'm at. I've got two walkways beside me, so I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of strapped for space this way. So, but it's still pretty good. I still have the uh, camera rotation on, um, so when I do 
turn left or right it doesn't matter it's pretty um you know it it, 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 it at least covers my bases but i've just pretty much got all my obs streams uh chat everything else is running here on the right side so i do have two monitors though Hey, what's up, Jorge? How are you, man? Hey, Nico. So this is from A plus B Software. That's spelled out. A P L U S B, the letter B, software.com. And they're out of Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. And it's got the high and range, the high and low range, and it's got the split on the backside. It doesn't have the engine brake. Now, the only other company that does one is the guy that's selling them off of uh, eBay, and he's out of Poland. So here's a more Euro truck, but this one works uh, just exactly the same. So Outrageous TV, thank you for your subscription. Appreciate it, guys. As always, I think, um, I think you know what? Let me just hang on just a second. All right, I'm gonna move. Uh, let me let me do something real quick. I'm gonna move my uh, camera down here, my wheel cam. I'm gonna move it all the way down to the bottom. That way, all of these alerts are gonna come up on the top. <laughs> Nobody's getting their big shout outs tonight. Whoops. Okay. Um, after third. Uh, all right. Let's let's see what this. Let's see if it does it again. Yeah, there we go. All right. Outrage has got two shout outs. <laughs> there we go. All right. Good deal. All right. So now all of our stuff will come across. Uh, so how to do with the engine brake. So I just assigned the engine brake to a button. Uh, and then when I push it, it activates it. Typically, um, you know, you might would have an engine brake uh, like the Euro Truck Series. Some of the manufacturers actually put a button up here that activates the engine brake as you're, you know, shifting back and forth. Um, but a lot of that stuff in the Euro trucks now are, are really like automatic. I mean, they don't really have to do much for those. But somebody maybe that uh, actually is a Euro driver uh, wouldn't mind asking them. I need to. Hey, what's up there, Lego? Good to see you, man. Absolutely there, Gary. Just to invite you guys, please feel free to join in conversation. You guys are, uh, you know, encouraged to. So make sure that uh, hopefully you guys uh, make sure the weed was hit really good there because uh, we are fixing across the border. Like what? Oh, that looked good. <laughs> yeah, we'd have bought them out on that one already. Wow. Wow, that looked good, man. <laughs> that looked really good. Oh, yeah, thanks, Nick. It does fit well. I, I actually bought my, um, I bought the, the the wheel and made sure that the the length of the jaw, well, I made sure it was large enough to get over my desk. Sure did. Does he gamer mom and dad? If I did, I missed what you guys said. If not, uh, how did I come up with my screen name? Good question. I will answer that here in just a minute. Uh, I don't know contact if it will. It's all it is is though it's an essentially a push button. Uh, it's in like an Arduino board. It's, it's what they call it. It's like a small little USB board that plugs in here. It says one USB. It's just an assignable button. So each one has a button, a switch on and off. So it's very possible that it would that it would probably work. Um, yeah. How was up there, Outrage? How are you, man? Shamar gun is the shifter worth the money? I think so. Uh, that's just me. What's up there, Jeremy? How are you, man? Uh, I think it's personally worth it uh, because what I used to have to do is I was using the small six-speed. Uh, I would have to sign like L2 and L3 here. I'd have to sign both of these, um, my switch and my flip. So now I can do the full entire 18 gears with just my pinky on the backside right here is a, a switch. And then I've got one here on my thumb right here. So each one of those I can flip and go from four to five on the the back side and then i can go high low here so if i need to just grab a high gear i can if i want to go down to low gears i can depending on how much power the truck has so that allows me to be able to just steer uh and do all three things spread spread you know on all three uh you know i don't know 
what you want to call that triangulation there is all different so that way i can do all 18 gears in one one entire uh thing and i don't have to worry about getting up here and reaching buttons and pushing buttons on the steering wheel that kind of stuff so it's a lot easier man a lot easier what's up there sean how are you man what's up there zach oh wow this truck came uh came barreling out of nowhere oh look at it we're gonna have to merge let's go ahead and let them know we're here There we go. That's how they do it in America, right? I think that's how they do it. <laughs> hey, what's up, Core? How are you, man? Ryan Riotti, three person. Three person, third person, please. There you go. That was a little three person. What's up there, Gray Buck? How are you, man? <laughs> please, life. <laughs> Got a little traffic jam here in Tijuana. I'm in to put the uh, I'm in to put the cat. Uh, that would have been everything else to have the scraper and it be cat too. I like how the suspension there, man. That's that's good stuff. Yeah, man, no problem. We'll, we'll do some more third person. I, I typically just remind me, and, and I, I need to. I enjoy the, you know, inside the cab, uh, but but I I do enjoy third person. It's nice to actually get outside and look at it, especially when you're rolling down the road. <laughs> That's how they do it in ATL. Absolutely, vegan waffles. What's up? A lot of new guys, man. So welcome to all you guys. Thank y'all for coming in and hanging out with us here, and also saying hey and all that good jazz. Appreciate it, fellas. Uh, quick view of the sleeper, sure. Uh, I think it'll let me. Uh, I think it'll let me turn around. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, so and not not nothing special. Just uh, you know, just enough to catch some seas whenever I need it. Antonio, what's up, man? Chalupa, what's up? Oh, Tupala. Oh, you said Chalupa. What's up? <laughs> Aiden Reeves, what's up, man? Yes, this is Mexico map, there, Josh absolutely is as one of my favorites I, I enjoy the regular stuff i enjoy new mexico but i feel like new mexico looks exactly like arizona looks exactly like the rest of them all right so we're actually floating gears now i wish i could show you my left foot you guys always wonder are you floating gears i am today i can float on the way up i just can't float them back down Uh, Mexico Zach is only here uh, if you download the mod so it is a modded map but it does give you basically the whole entire uh, peninsula the Baja Peninsula and then it gives you uh, the interior of Mexico as well and quite a bit of it uh, to boot it's actually quite a, it's quite a bit of stuff man Wow 109 serious Walter Wow Wow man <laughs> <DJ>. <laughs> Uh, do I play on multiplayer? Okay, so Nico, yes, I am going to start. Uh, one thing that we wanted, and I have to throw this out right quick, is we got a brand new TeamSpeak here with Full Tilt Gaming. So if you're looking for a community, you're looking for a place to join, uh, then you are more than welcome here. We don't have any kind of special rules. Well, we do have rules, but I mean, it's not like, hey, only a certain group of guys can join. Anybody can join. Uh, and obviously, thank you there, Devon. Or Devin. Is it Devin Shaleen? Appreciate it, man. Um, so at any, at any point uh, you guys want to I've got the link to the uh, we've got our SOP which is our kind of our rules our rule book uh, and then it's actually got some stuff on there as well as well as our address so if you want to put that download TeamSpeak 3 icon look at this guy busting a move so if you want to go ahead and download TeamSpeak 3 the client uh, you can just google it and it'll take you right to it it's great it's free Sergeant Baroni Cole oh Cole Haggard good to see you as well and we got one more rolling in hey what's up sean how are you man world gaming plays what's up and who was that sergeant baroni there it is let's see let me figure out what gear i'm in yeah is that first yeah there we go hey 
Ben Klein, what's up, man? <laughs> By the tables have turned. If you got anybody that enjoys go watching some good, funny Twitch stuff, uh, I don't normally go to Twitch, but I met Incline. He came in and hung out with us there uh, at YouTube. I forget what, maybe it was Gold Rush, the very beginning of Gold Rush. And he came in and sponsored the channel for a month. And I went there last night and hung out and uh, been watching. He's been doing a lot of these little freaky, kind of scary, crazy games. And uh, he's just a fun guy to watch. So if you're, uh, if you're, you know, it's it's fun, it's good content. So, um, you know, it, it's it's awesome. So thanks, man, for coming and hanging out, dude. I appreciate it, man. Jay did some, I see Barbara Grill Hunt. Get all you guys in here. So, uh, uh, is that Barbara or Barbara? Grill Hunt, Jaden Jensen, and Dundies. There's the Dundies coming in. Thank you, man. Appreciate that subscriptions, guys. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yeah, man, no problem, dude. No problem. I enjoyed myself. I actually laughed uh, and laughed out loud. <laughs> I went like snurking, you know, just behind. I was like, <laughs> it's kind of funny. But the game was kind of, you know, but, but you actually make it kind of fun because that, that's exactly what I'd be saying if I was in there battling Bindi and the ink machine. <laughs> uh, what does arrive mean? Okay, real, all right, real quick. You guys will have to slow down a little bit on the questions because I'm having trouble keeping up and being able to drive and keep it in my lane. But we'll do the best we can. So, uh, the arrival is just kind of in honor of our X-Plane that just kind of started off here recently. Uh, I am going to change them up now that you can do multiple profiles. So we'll have a truck one. And, but it's just a set of alerts that's uh, like the arrivals, departures, uh, you know, people that are checking in with like a super chat, those kinds of things. Uh, so it's just uh, it's based off of our X-Plane stream. That's all it is. So, um, And then someone asked what the mod and the truck was. Uh, the mod is uh, Vipers 389. You can Google it. You'll have to get it. Uh, you can get the Vipers 389 out of the workshop. You can also get all this wonderful skins that I have out of the workshop. This is by Pauly. You guys know him. He does all the Caterpillar skins for pretty much everything ATS. Uh, so go grab that. He does a fantastic job with everything he touches is gold um, and gold colored. So I like I like the gold colored Caterpillar stuff. So he's one of the best of, of the biz and he does them all free there for everyone to have. So is that uh, Point K Gaming? So thank you, man. Appreciate that. So anyway, that's the two things that I've got on there. Um, so yeah, I hope that I hope that answers your questions there on that. Uh, Rasta, what state do I live in? I'm in North Carolina. North Carolina. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's weird, man. It, I, you know, I just actually, yeah, it's kind of, I mean, I'm a little bit excited because I was just planning on a real nice, easy kind of chill. And then Walter's like, hey, there's a hundred dumb people watching. I'm like, what? Yeah, I just figured, you know, we'd have our crew in here. It'd be cool. We'd just drive back down to Mexico again, had some new mods. I was like, shoot, yeah, this will be, this will be fun. And uh, yeah, lo and behold, man, everybody shows up and I actually got to work tonight. You'll be tired trying to do all this. <laughs> All nice. Hey, and a new one, man. Mr. Hayden Reeves. So good to have you on board there, Hayden. Appreciate it, buddy. Should uh, actually get a, uh, we should actually get a, uh, a notification come through. Here it comes. Yeah, there it is. Appreciate that, bud. Uh, except you can't read your name. Sorry about that. I, I, I need to redo that now on my ATS. I had to update everything. <laughs> oh, no. No, we didn't. No, we didn't. <laughs> Oh, welcome to Mr. Incline. If you are so inclined to be on Twitch and go, 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 give that guy a follow and go uh, check some of his stuff. It's good stuff. It's funny stuff. He's always streaming. And he just seems like a. Uh, I don't know him personally, but he just seems like a uh, like a good guy. So um, looks like a guy that I'd go uh, want to go have a beer with. So welcome, man. Glad to have you on board. Man, it took us all through. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot. We can we can actually uh, we got the tow trucks in here as well. So, you know, kind of like they do. Uh, we can actually tow three of the Peterbilts or Kenworth stat together. We got that mod in here as well. So, <laughs> yeah, that's cool. 
Well, let's go ahead and we'll just kiss the roof here on our way through. Hey, these lights are getting on my nerves. Hey there, King. Appreciate it, man. Do I play ETS? Absolutely, Devin, I do. Uh, ironically, I like ETS probably more just because the scenery is way more advanced. Um, but people watch ATS a lot more. So, I tried the Dalton map there, Josh, and I, I didn't really like it. Um, it just wasn't my thing. I tried the winter and the summer versions, and it just, I don't know, I felt like I was driving forever, and I was just seeing the same thing, no vegetation, no trees. I was like, oh, boy, this is terrible. Um, so, yeah, I, I just kind of did that one back away. Oh, my. Yeah, I got real. Oh, I got you, man. Oh, it's all good, man. All good. It wouldn't have mattered if you had stopped it. I'm always appreciative of uh, what, you know, what anybody does. I know you know the feeling, so. No worries, man. No worries. What's up, man? Um, like, uh, David, probably next live stream for Gold Rush. Probably tomorrow night. More than likely. Uh, Ice Roads version, yeah. Kind of the Dalton map kind of does that, but not really. Um, it doesn't really do the physics, at least uh, if I remember correctly, it doesn't actually complete the physics on the um, when you're doing it. So uh, I'm not exactly sure, to be honest with you. I can't remember on ATS. I know ETS has got a lot of stuff, like if Pro Mods has got some ice parts in it that actually have snow and have the physics of it as well. So you do slip and slide a little bit. Um, but as for this one, the only one I can think of that might would be the Dalton Road, the winter version, the Dalton map. Uh, and that's like, that, it's kind of, a, uh, it's kind of complicated. It's not exactly the, the easiest thing, but um, to get that one up and running, it's a little more complicated than just put a map in, a, you know, in your, 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 uh, your mod, whatever, your stack, and then just roll out with it. I see there, Melon. Get a little faster. <laughs> well, if they stop me with this big scraper on the back, then I guess they, they deserve to stop. <laughs> hey, what's up, Danzo? How are you, man? Oh, nice, dude. Got the 920. Yeah, man, it's good. It's good steering wheel. I, I would have, if you know, doing this, I think it was perfect. If I was uh, maybe getting into so like some racing and doing some serious stuff, I was probably going to go down the uh, the Thrustmaster side. But yeah, it's, it's, it's good. The only thing I wish sometimes that I wish I would have done is one with the TH, uh, the T8HA, which is the Thrustmaster one. Um, but, you know, this one being able to plug directly into the seared wheel and it'd be all one package, that's, that's worth it. Hey, what's up there, Aiden? How are you, man? Go rush. Hey. Well, you know, and that's okay. And that's, you know, the. the um, is this the triaxle? This is the quad axle, Josh. <laughs> this is the quad axle, bro. <laughs> He's like, wait, wait, what? Yeah, is this the quad? Let me, let me, let me get to a little bit of a. Uh, well, we can do it here. There you go. Okay. Whoop. There we go. All right. 
Yeah, absolutely. Uh, contact. I would. I would. I would agree with that. Oh, Chris, that's the comment of the evening right there, man. I don't really enjoy Gold Rush, but I watch. I enjoy watching others play so that I don't have to. <laughs> that's uh, that's actually kind of a that's clever, man. I like it. <laughs> uh, yeah, Demario Sanderson, thank you for your subscription. Appreciate it, man. Oh yeah, man. I'm sure that the bill and ease would be a be a nice and hefty. <laughs> Thank you there, Aiden. Appreciate it, man. All right. So moving right along. The only thing I like about Mexico. <laughs> hey, what's up there, blood? Yeah, man, this is uh, Mexico. So we are on the, I guess we're on the inside track there of the uh, Baja Peninsula. Ah, oh, thank you there, David. Appreciate it, man. Little pucker factor there, man. That bus came rolling. Hey, what's up, man? Any giveaways? Uh, yes, actually, I wasn't going to say, but yes, actually, yes. Uh, Friday, we'll be giving away another copy of the DLC there, Frankenstein DLC, and a copy of the game for Gold Rush. Yeah, blood, it certainly is, man. So we're down uh, San Felipe. So once we get here uh, at our place, wherever we stop, I'll uh, we'll take a look at the map there for people that may want to, you know, see what it's got on it and see what's uh, see what it's about. It's a good map. I, I, Mexico is my favorite by far. Uh, there's a couple of, there's an extreme roads uh, kind of side to it at the very south end of it that's really, really, really nice. Uh, but this one's a little more subdued. So he's got some nice cutbacks and uh, some really nice roads on the interior side of Mexico uh, that's absolutely fantastic. So I enjoy, uh, I enjoy those. I don't know, this one probably couldn't do that one. Not with traffic on, we'd get stuck. That's why, that's why I took this down here, so. <laughs> if you're inclined, <laughs> tap the bell. There you go, man. There you go. Uh, the new Mex? Uh, no. Uh, yeah, blood. This is the this is Viva Mexico. Yep, this is the new. Uh, I have not tried that one. Um, I didn't really have a, a ton of time to break in a whole new you know a new map set on that. Uh, so I don't know if that one works with everything else I've got on here. I've got a ton of mods on this one, so. Barriers. <laughs> yeah, uh, we're, we're probably going to be testing them soon enough. <laughs> yeah, we are pulling old train of cars. I like. I don't know, man. I, I like it. I've always liked Mexico. Uh, it's 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 always been one of my faves on here. So, and it's a good solid mod as well. The guys actually take quite a bit of time. Actually, the guys that did the Viva Mexico, they came in here. Uh, this has been a while back. I mean, it's been a couple of months. Uh, before they did all this uh, New Mexico add-in and whatnot, um, they came in and were just watching me drive through all these different places and making notes and just kind of seeing people stream the map. It just came out, um, so that was really cool to see that. They're obviously one of those uh, developers that takes a lot of care and consideration about their mod. You know, it's their name, it's their hard work, and they're uh, basically providing them for just donations. Um, you know, kind of the same thing we do here at YouTube as streamers and stuff. Uh, it's up to you guys to really decide whether or not you like the content, those kinds of things. 
um, but it comes to you free without charge um, so that's the same way with mods I mean most of the stuff is all trademarked where they really can't sell it um, so that's why you never see people that do these awesome mods but they just do it as like donation wear never comes across as something that has to be bought so um, that's kind of nice but uh, then again it's it's a lot of work a lot of work to bring this stuff out so that's why I always say go support streamers go support modders uh, any of these map makers I've done the same for just about all of these guys so um, I know I know what it's like to put a lot of work into stuff so definitely if you find those stuff and you find your guys they really do a really killer job with mods paints Polly's another really great guy to go support because he does a ton of stuff for the community. Um, you know, support those guys. Give, keep them motivated so that they come uh, and continue to make stuff here for your favorite games uh, instead of just take, 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 take and don't give anything in return. Because eventually when they stop doing it, there'll be nobody else uh, to come in and do it. So, there you go. That's my soapbox. I'll slip right off that thing and sit back down in my seat and we'll continue driving. Oh, spent time with the wife. What? Get out of here, man. Tell, tell her it's research. Researching, honey. Researching. <laughs> no, nah, man. I understand. I'm in the same boat. I was in your stream last night, and she went out the window and knocked on the door. She's like, you plan on coming to bed anytime soon? I was like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> See, have a good man. Have a good one. There we go. All right, so uh, I'll revision. All right, I have no idea what the. I mean, maybe this is the toll. I have a good in there, David. Oh, it's gonna be a tight fit with this scraper on the back. And there it is. So, Ram Gamer YouTube, thank you for your subscription. Appreciate it. And also, Mr. Snowbird Gaming. A lot of gaming's coming in tonight. So, welcome, guys. <laughs> I like that. was a gold rush. You know, gold rush has been fun. You guys, y'all, 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 give it all down the road. It's been fun. I've enjoyed Gold Rush. It's a good game. It's good. It's been good on the channel. There's a lot of guys here like watching it. And, um, yeah, obviously, you guys are like, hey, if you streaming. DTS is let's go let's hit it oh well thanks Kenneth appreciate that man well I try to man I, I've got to keep it interesting for myself you know I got to keep it interesting for myself I can't continue to just keep doing the same same stuff every day man it's just like wow this grind is literally getting it's getting real <laughs> devil haters man Nah, I don't even give them a dab, dude. It's not wasted. It's not even wasting a dab. Deuce MS, what's up, man? I see you up there. How's it going? Yes, man. What's up? I hope you're doing well there, bud. I almost missed your, uh, almost missed your comment back here, man. All right. So I tell you what, you guys are wanting to know maps and all that stuff. Let me just set it up real quick here. Um, so here is. Oh, we're almost there, San Felipe. So we are in. This is Viva Mexico. So. Um, we're right now going down the Baja Peninsula, so I eventually want to make it all the way down here to Cabo San Lucas. Uh, and then uh, we're, as we welcome in Mr. Uh, Cam Campbell, one, uh, welcome to the channel. Thank you for your subscription. Appreciate that, man. Uh, so we're going to go down somewhere down this way. I don't know where. We're just, we're just kind of hit and miss and pick what we can on the way down. Uh, but we've got two different parts. So Viva Mexico starts uh, up here at El Centro and Carlsbad, or uh, the south end of San Diego. So it has this nice pull off here, San Diego, and joins you up with Tijuana. Uh, and all of this here that you see is all Viva Mexico. And OJ Richards, thank you, man. Appreciate it. So there's a couple of really, really, if you guys like, challenging, challenging, challenging roads. Uh, I'll go Prieta all the way down to Yokora and back up uh, to Moctezuma. All of these, all of these roads, you can see them. They are insane and they are so much fun. Uh, and then the same down here. Uh, these roads right here are like ridiculous and they're so much fun. All these are down kind of, uh, all set down into like the, the mountainous areas. Uh, and you've got a nice circle to all the way down here. So I think this was the Durango edition 2.4. So 2.5 is going to bring in all of this, or at least it's going to join all these together and it's going to connect up here. Uh, I believe it's San Simon and Las Cruces. So both of these places are going to connect down in roads and, then, and maybe connect over to Agua Prieta. I'm not exactly sure how they're going to do it. Uh, and then maybe over here at Yocora as well. But anyway, 
all that's going to be coming in as Mexico. So if you think about it, you've got these four states here. And Mexico literally itself is awesome, as you can see. And it gets better. The other side's a little bit more busy with a lot more smaller towns and that kind of stuff. Uh, but it's still awesome. Awesome scenery, awesome uh, mountains, red dirt, all that kind of good stuff. But anyway, that's a whole entire map here uh, is, is really at your taking again. So you get tired of driving up here. The Viva Mexico works with everything, and those guys are super quick about updating it. So that's what map we're running. So if you want to Google Viva, or V, I think it's V I V A Mexico 2.4, uh, and that's what map we're running. So if you can Google that; it'll pull up in one of your uh, one of the map uh, one of the mods sites. Um, just be careful in the mod sites. A lot of times you can don't get over clicky. Uh, delete tabs when they come up and stuff you know it's a lot of times it, it's any of those mods that have got a lot of adware uh those kinds of things i mean you just have to delete them out but they're aggravating i would suggest go in with some ad blocker like if you're using google chrome go download uh go to extensions in your browser and download um ad blocker it'll you'll you'll know it and if you don't then go back and look uh google that again and say how to download uh download something like that and it'll hook you up that's what I do, and I never have an issue, never have a problem, so. Oh, yeah, Devin's using Coast to Coast. Awesome. Hey, what's up, Clint? <laughs> Good to see you, man. Hey, what's up there, Stacey Press? How are you? I, I can't see anybody above Stacy. so if you said hey or something in my little spill there about the map, uh, please feel free to go ahead and uh, yeah, throw something back up in chat again. Do I love Space Mountain? Eh. Yeah. Spent the night wandering through Walt Disney World. Wow. <laughs> hey, what's up there, Rocky? How are you, man? All right, so let's uh, give you guys a good look here on the outside. And we've got the quad axle, as you can see. We've got the big old quad axle uh, heavy haul chassis on, on the back here. And we just got the small sleeper. We don't even have the big one on there. Core's here today. Yes, well, he was in here. Hey, what's up there, OJ? How are you, man? Uh, yeah, Core was in the house earlier. I'm not sure if he's still in here, but yeah, he was. <laughs> so, so I'm done with it. Did you get tired of Gold Rush, Clint? <laughs> it's like, oh my God, I wish he'd stop, stop digging. Stop digging for Gold bro. Where is our turn in? All right, I guess it's up here. Uh, let's clear. There we go. Let's clear that off. So yeah, what you got, OJ? Throw it up, Aaron. Ran. Hey, oh nice, nice, Tim. Getting a new computer. Yeah, it's a sexy truck. Absolutely, man. Take this truck out on a date. Nope. Oh, light pole. Nope. We're good. All right. Oh. Uh, okay. This is not the bad one. I had to say there's there's a really bad one of these we're, we're not going to do the backup thing at least i don't think so i don't think the four axle truck i can manage to get it back then what's up there jacob morgan how are you there hey what's up michael e man good to see you if i've missed anybody you guys uh, don't don't hesitate to go ahead and uh throw up another hey in chat all right, let's see here. Let's uh, let's do this. Let's uh, add up another one. I'll stop my head from turning. All right. So now that I've got that one, let's go ahead and let's back this thing all the way up if we can.
probably, yeah, we're not going to hit this one. Maybe, maybe. Nice! Yeah, man, uh, SKRS, absolutely. A plus B software. <laughs> that skill rank. <laughs> uh, do, I, do I have a wife? Do I have a life? Do you have a wife? Yes, I do. Uh, a plus B software.com. So there you go. So there is. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we made it. Barely. Barely. Uh, so yes, yeah, so that's what we've got. A plus B software is where you want to go to if you want to look at this. S Grace about a hundred bucks. All of them are, are right at a hundred. Um, and it's a little, you know, I know on the surface that's a little steep, but if you enjoy ATS, you can run it well, uh, and you enjoy driving and stuff. It's a pretty killer mod. To, it's a pretty cool modification here to have. Um, well, these all kind of stink. <clears throat> Kind of not really your heavy haul. Uh, I guess we could take... Uh, oh, that's going back up. Dang, of course it is. Um, yeah, it kind of stinks. Didn't really have anything great in here. I guess we could... I guess we could take the genie lifts down there. I, yeah, it's not really what I wanted to take, but... Mm. Let's do, let's see what's in El Rosario. Do we got, okay, we do have at least a heavy haul in there. We've got some other things, sand, <laughs> we take some groceries, uh, we've got an office. So we could, we could, we could, uh, we could give all that the, the official name of a uh, construction a trailer. <laughs> all right, let's do that. Let's just take the case. Nope, 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 nope. Let's take our genie lifts on around. Sure, why not? So thank you there, Timothy Triggers. Appreciate that subscription as well. All right, see you there, Kenneth. We will absolutely catch you on the next run there, bud. Absolutely, man. Yeah, this is a sharp rig. So let's do this. Let's uh, before we do that, let's um, let's go ahead and sleep here. Uh, let's get it back in the daylight. Uh, okay, what, what, go ahead there, your question up there again, OJ. I missed it, man. My bad. I'm, I'm all for helping if it's something I, I knew off the top of my head. I know these programs pretty well, especially ATS and ETS when it comes to mods. Let's see if it's going to let me sleep or if I'm going to go the other side. Eh, of course we go to the other side. Hey, what's up, Josh? Yeah, I know. I know I need a big load for a huge truck. Well, hopefully we get another huge haul there on uh, Rosario. But until then, we'll just take some scissor lifts. That's all we got. I don't even have like a good trailer. I could even pretend we're taking it somewhere. Not unless we, you know, took some groceries to Walmart or something. Uh, I mean, yes, the cat, straight pipe, C15. Absolutely. Can I? Can you make a Trucker's MP account? Well, you can do that, man. So, Trucker's MP, dude, go to World of Trucks and do it. And then you join your game up to World of Trucks. If you've been banned out of World of Trucks, then I'm not doing it. So, all you gotta do is go to World of Trucks and then do that. And I'll hook you right up, man. Alright, there we go. Let's see if our uh, let's see if our job's actually still there. It might not be. It may have recycled over. Let's see. All right, San Felipe. Oh, 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 that's for literally right next door. That sucks. Okay, dang it. That would have been a great one. All right, so uh, Chad Choice. So we're going down. Uh, that one's leading back up. We don't want to go down. I guess we're just going to have to go with the cable reel. Is that okay there, buddy? Cable reel? Is that where we're going? <laughs> uh okay so jaden asked uh where did he get the computer from 
Um, so the computer is from Digital Storm. As you can see, we're powered by Digital Storm right there in that cam there. Um, Digital Storm is an awesome place. DigitalStormPC.com. Go check them out. I have a referral with them, a referral program. So if you guys do purchase uh, a computer there, I've got. I've already had two guys have purchased. Absolutely love the computers. I've got one that's thinking about it right now. Uh, and if he does go through with it, then uh, that'll be the third one and hopefully the third uh, happy cups. Now, at the very bottom of my video, I have got a um, kind of a little reveal of my experience behind what I got with it, what the computer, what's in it, all the specs on it. Um, I've kind of got all that stuff all set up down there. So if you want to go check that video out whenever you want to, uh, I mean, you can go do it now if you want to. Uh, then go over to Digital Storm PC and go check them out. And you can build it. It's like a custom, but they build it for you. They provide everything. Three-year limited warranty uh, on all the parts and all the labor. Um, wonderful customer service. I've actually had a call because I screwed something up and didn't know what I did. Uh, and those dudes literally fixed it remotely for me, and it was absolutely awesome. So uh, it is a little bit more on the more expensive side, but I'm, I'm a firm believer if you do get what you pay for. Uh, and if it, I look at the PC gaming, I look at all this stuff as an investment. So I treat it as such. They have a wonderful finance program. It was 12 months, no interest um, if you qualify, which is not too hard to qualify on that. So, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's a really good deal. It's a really good deal. All right, so I think what we're going to have to do here, unless, let's see if this, uh, I think this cable reel is going to be right here. All right, let's do, uh, let's see if it's here. Yep, there it is. All right, good. So that's going to take us straight south. That's awesome. Manuel, welcome, man. Thank you for your subscription. Well, let's cut us a Yui here. Let's pick up our cable reel. Go well with our cat truck. All right. Uh... Oh, whoops. Sorry there, bud. All right. Uh, so, Devin, do I like the candy map? Um, I'm kind of curious what you mean by the candy map. Wait a minute. Did I not just get the? Did I not just get the load? time <clears throat> that was weird like it completely disappeared all right let's try that one more time yeah okay well it's gone that gum we must have just missed it then um shoot all right, well, that's uh, that's not where I want to go. All right, well, looks like we're taking a JCB, uh, and I'm just going to continue to go on south with it. I'm, we're not going to, I'm not going to go all the way back up there to, uh, was that Mexicali? Yeah, what's up here? Um, road rollers, yeah, nothing. Okay, yeah. All right, let's take, uh, we'll take, we'll take this down, JCB. There you go. We'll take it on down to uh, Punta Prieta. That's where we'll go. Okay, wait a minute. All right, so what the heck? So we've got the cable reel, but I'm not seeing it. Hey, what's up there, Jason XR? Caden Cooksey, what's up, man? Hey, what headphones? Uh, hang on a minute. <laughs> Let me figure out what my problem is here. Oh, okay, I didn't go far enough. And it's like, okay, all right, it's like I didn't have that little uh, flag on the map. Okay. <laughs> My bad, fellas. Sorry, I look like a noob driving around here. Uh, okay, Devin, uh, the candy map. Oh, oh, you mean Canada map. I personally don't like it. I'm not a big fan of it. Um, Mexico is my map. I love Mexico. Um, I think it's actually better than probably the, the... I think Mexico map is better than New Mexico. 
I know probably some people just went, <gasps> I, I really do. I really do. Uh, if you look at the amount of stuff that you get, the scenery, the, the coastlines, I mean, it's ridiculous. So, yeah, I mean, I think in a way it's, it's a little, even a little bit better. But that's just my own humble one's opinion. So, uh, what's the HP on the cat truck? I believe this one's 620. I don't even have the big engine in it. But I've got a heck of a transmission in this thing. <laughs> hey, thank you there, Jib. Is that the Jibril? Jibril Sadim? Thank you, man. Appreciate it. I will do what I can. All right. So, Caden asked, "What kind of uh, what kind of headset we got?" I think this is the uh, 520. So, this is the Turtle Beach Stealth 520. Basically, it's the PlayStation Plus PC counterpart. It's wireless. Uh, it's got a bunch of different sound modes. Sounds great. Um, looks good. It feels good. Uh, the mic microphone on it's pretty good. Um, I just don't have the desk space as well as the outside space to put up a complete boom with, you know, the whole microphone and the, all that. Uh, yeah, not, not yet. Not yet. One of these days, yes, but as of right now, no. There's no point in doing that. Um, so, yeah, so this is absolutely perfect for what I'm using it for. Oh, Jay, this is the Viva Mexico 2.4. That's the literal name for it. Viva Mexico 2.4. <laughs> I wouldn't want to haul them either, Deuce. <laughs> Jamaica, tune it in, bro. Bless. All right, man. Very cool, man. Awesome. All the way from Jamaica. Always, There's always such an eclectic group of guys, man, to come in for ATS streams. It's some, actually kind of quite amazing. The uh, X-Plane brings in a certain group of people, you know, um, Gold Rush brings in a super group of guys, and then ATS is just like out of nowhere. Uh, Brazil, Mexico, I mean, just all over the place. So it's wonderful to have you guys here in live stream with us. <laughs> nice, Michael. Nice. Yeah. Don't tell my wife that. And I won't tell yours. <laughs> uh, it's literally, I think, in the description. The Viper's 389. And it's all workshop. So the paint is in the workshop. Uh, we're going to take that car out. Oh, man, we took our suspension out. Oh, oh, yep. Okay. We'll have to turn that one down on insurance. That's all right. I've inspired Nick T to hop on the road. <laughs> I feel an ATS live stream uh, multiplayer coming on pretty soon there. What do you think there, Nick? Ah, oh, nice. So this is the cool thing about Twitter uh, is the fact that, you know, you guys can follow me and I'm all up for tweeting pictures. Uh, and uh, and guys that come in and you know I'll turn that to the side. There you go. So there's Nick T's new updated ride. So he's able to tweet me a couple pictures of it. So good looking ride there, bud. Even got the red trailers. So he's all matchy matchy now. So he's uh, joining the club. Very cool, man. Good good looking truck there. And he's what are you carrying though? What is that? Is that the transformer? I think it was. So uh, if you guys want to, let's see. Let's let's do um, let's do this. So we can go back to this screen. Uh, there on the top left of your screen there, uh, we've got our Steam community name, but we also got Full Tilt. That is my Twitter handle, so you can reach me there, at Full Tilt. So uh, follow me there, and I will uh, follow some people back, especially if, you know, but hey, feel free to uh, tweet me your rides, pictures of ATS, whatever you got going on, and some of those I will retweet. Some of those I can retweet or do whatever with, uh, but yeah. And it also gives me a chance, too, with some of these screenshots and whatnot that I have. Uh, gives me an opportunity to tweet some of my picks out. You guys can have those for whatever you want. Uh, if you like Caterpillar, you want those for a desktop screen, or uh, you want it for a phone background, iPad background, whatever. It's yours to do with. I don't, I don't claim any copyright stuff on that as long as you guys are trying to sell the screenshot. But then you might have to like, you know, you might have to cough up some cash for SCS. But anyway, man, man <laughs> it's kind of corny. <laughs> Stalker Club followers. Ah, oh, Dennis, don't look at you guys. Stalkers, man. Nice to make it in Manchester. Very sweet, man. Well, glad to have you guys along, man. Yeah, <laughs> I texted driving, right? 
Ah, what level? Nexus. I have no idea. Whatever this modded profile was. <laughs> just, uh, you know, just being honest. I wish, uh, you know, what, what is that? Two? Is that, what is that? That's billion? Which, well, million? Billions? For two billion dollars? Yeah, I'm just... Yeah. I, the level is ridiculous, but that's just uh, the way the profile came. I would love to be able to sit around and do, you know, like, a, like literally do it legit, but I just don't have the time to keep all this stuff up and then got family and all the other stuff added on top of that it makes it a lot it makes it a lot oh I hear you man get the truck for the anniversary what wow I need to know your secrets there Ethan Well, we all we are hauling the cable reels. So good, 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 good segue into a third-person boat here. So let me get up here where it's a little bit straighter. There we go. So there's the heavy haul. Brand new cat skin there by Mr. Polly. You know, you guys know him. If you know Caterpillar, Mr. Polly is one of the best in the biz. So actually, thank you for his continued work. It's awesome to see it. So yeah, it looks like a Ferris wheel. I know. That's one big cable reel. <laughs> so the cool thing about the Mexico mod is there's two really two totally separate different places. So we've got uh, we've got mainly your your inside of what I guess you would call this your eastern side of the Baja Peninsula, uh, which is where we're at. The little piece that juts out there on the uh, out out south of California. Um, so we've got. Uh, more of a coastline kind of look, and I think Pimex, I think Pimex is cement. I think that's a cement or oil refinery, I can't remember. Um, maybe that's Sumex is cement, but anyway. Um, so we've got more of a coastline feel on this side. If you went to the other side, uh, you basically have this really much different changeover in a more, um, more mountainous region. Um, a lot more hills, a lot more uh, really high-end, you know, mountain kind of traversing back and forth and just a lot of low gear crawling up the mountainside and uh, really jake breaking down the whole entire thing or using your retarder, whichever one's your uh, weapon of choice to slow down. But yeah, so you got really two separate maps kind of combined into one really nice, easy to drive through map. So uh, it's really, really, really cool. I'm, I'm as like I say, I mean, there's, there's some things you come uh, come across that are really, really, really good, and you just hope that those guys continue to keep, you know, updating the mods because it seems like this stuff changes every single time, uh, you know, SES decides to change something up. So I don't even have dirt roads out here. That's right, Nick. Big old uh, gazillion dollars. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I would, I would, I would do there, Jay Paul. <laughs> Stevenson that's that that's a pretty nice hefty find luckily this is a sim and we can't get trouble because we done be broke I'm not sure how fast you go it says it says 55 but I'm not sure if uh, obviously we're we're picking up some uh, we're picking up some wheel dust here, so obviously I guess it, it's got some physical properties of dirt. At least I assume it does. I have no idea. Seventeen and loving the teen life. Well, happy teen birthday. Oh, what is this? A, a water crossing down here? Is a bridge? <laughs> Well, this is new. I don't remember this mess. Ah. Yeah, that might that might have been a uh, might have messed that one up. Yeah, they did. 
<laughs> okay, alright. What if? That's cool. <laughs> Oh yeah, 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 we're sliding. Ooh. Slow down. What? Yeah, so we are sliding here in third. Wow. It's pretty legit there. I don't think I expected that to, uh, yeah, I don't think I expected that. I really don't remember any of this. Now, I can't remember if I'm, um, I can't remember if I ever rode on this particular part of the road before, because none of this feels familiar. I think I was always on the other side. Back on the road, all right. Glad we saw the ups man coming in. <laughs> Hey, thank you there, Cole. Appreciate it, man. And I don't know if I got Manuel Martinez. I don't know. Maybe maybe you came in second there on off of Timothy's. I, maybe I, if I didn't get you, I'm sorry. So I hope you, if you're still around, uh, thank you for your subscription, man. And uh, thank you there to you as well, Cole. 4 a.m. comes early. Absolutely there. All right, same to you there, Lego. Same to you, man. Thank you guys for coming in and hanging out with us here a little bit tonight. Appreciate that. Uh, pick of the up train. What do you mean by the up train? You don't have to let me know there. Oh, look at this. We got a... Really? That was weird. <laughs> We're seeing all kind of new stuff here. <laughs> Woo! Wow. <laughs> all kind of new stuff I'm not used to seeing out here. A cable car on the road. I, <laughs> I don't know if that's supposed to be there or not. I was like, well, wait a minute here. Oh, there goes some tumbleweed. It's kind of a nice touch. I like the tumbleweed. This must be like your filler map. <clears throat> Everything's all the same. You know, it's all the same. It's just back and forth, back and forth. I kind of hate when maps do this. It's annoying. Nothing, nothing challenging. There's no, there's no, there's no back and forth. This is and so. In comparison, people have asked me to, and especially in, in this stream, they've asked me uh, where, um, like, Canada Dream, Coast to Coast, a lot of Coast to Coast, a lot of Canada Dream is exactly like this. There's like, there's like this disconnect where they, there's certain parts of the map like they spent a lot of time on, then there was like the connector parts where they're like, oh, we'll just do it like a, okay, I'm tired of working on it tonight, and we'll just do this and this and this, and they're like, oh, we'll just leave that there. And then see, now you walk back into something they've obviously put a little bit of thought into. Um, so you've got houses and all kind of other little 
and the various little parts and pieces here off off to the side but yeah it's kind of kind of weird when they do that I don't I don't like it but you know all right let's see I see some Twitter messages coming through. Juan Pablo Herrera Guerrero. Guerra. Wow, that's a lot of R's, man. That's a, that's a stacked name. Welcome there, Juan. I hope you're doing well, man. Uh, train from the last ATS. A picture. Oh, of the train. Oh, I'll have to see if I can find one. I think I, I, I think I'll, uh, I think I can. So, bienvenidos there, Juan. Saluda me. Alright, well, here we are. Alright, so once we get up here, we'll uh, see where our park is and then we'll uh, let you guys get a good. We even got the heavy haul chassis on today. We've even got brand new cat skin here from Pauly. Uh, does all the uh, he does all the good caterpillar stuff but anyway he's done a new skin and this is vipers 389 and you can see on the inside i don't know if this is new uh oh if this is new to the truck uh but i don't remember ever being able to do a painted uh interior on this with the older older style panel so um it's kind of cool I, I didn't know this was a know that this was a thing so nice to uh nice to see some updates on this stuff especially as they move into 1.3 i think is what we're in now all right, let's see. Let's do... Oh, that's going to be pretty easy. All right, so Rocky wants to pick the truck, so let's do one more. I'll tweet a couple of these out. I'll, I'll mess with them a little bit, and uh, we'll do a couple of these, to, uh, and we'll send them up on our... Uh, put them up on my Twitter. So if you guys want to, uh, go ahead and think about following me there, at Full Tilled. That's F-U-L-L-T-I-L-L-E-D. And that will get you right on over. You can follow me there, and I'll tweet these out for all you guys. Uh, just talk about what the, uh, the amazing, uh, awesome stream we've had tonight. This has been a killer one. So let's uh, let's let's do that like that. If you don't mind the FTG license plate, <laughs> like, oh, can you take that off? No, forgot my screwdrivers. Sorry. <laughs> all right, let's see. Let's see if we can let's see if we can squeeze on over here. <laughs> nice shed. Truck is making my house shake. It's not even up that loud. Rock on. Absolutely, man. I, the headphones, uh, if it feels like I'm hollering, it's because they're turned up in the like, bass boost maximum. <laughs> it is good. It is good. Alrighty. Very good. Hey, what's up there, Ethan? Uh, have you been on the multiplayer? Uh, we were on multiplayer yesterday. What, when was that, Nick? Was that yesterday or the day before? If it was yesterday or the day before we got on uh, We got on Truckers MP. Uh, just trying to set the things up here for our own multiplayer stuff, which while we're kind of in the in the in the field in the in the field between here, um, so we'll be doing a couple of things as well. We will be moving and doing some multiplayer. So uh, go ahead and if you want to, you don't have to, but the multiplayer works best if we're all at least in the team speak and able to communicate. Um, so we do have rule sheets there. If you want to join the team speak here, but this is FTG, so it's not affiliated with anybody else. If you want to join the team speak, please feel free to. It's open, uh, it's free. So you can have uh, mobile apps, you can also have your PC apps. Uh, so then you download TeamSpeak 3, then there's a server address down there. Whenever you do, is uh, it'll ask you connect in a tab. Just connect, put that address with the colon and the four or five numbers after that's the port number, uh, and hit connect, and it'll bring you right in here, and we'll bring you to TeamSpeak and get you all uh, all set up here. You're more than welcome to come hang with us. Uh, it's not really just a place. To, I mean, you can come in and ask a question and leave if you want to, but if you want to come hang, it's open and it's available there for you guys to do that. So we will be using that as we do some Truckers MP, uh, as we get into some more multiplayer stuff. It won't always just be free willy-nilly, but if you are watching the stream and you want to try to tag along and try to keep up with us, you're more than welcome to do that. Um, and uh, and obviously, uh, hopefully we can have a really good time uh, doing any kind of multiplayer. So the success of that really depends upon you guys. So. 
Uh, so thank you there coming in, Mr. Dan Hanson, and I think Tommy was just uh, just subscribed. So thank you there to you as well, Tommy. Let's do one more. What about that? Let's do. Let's see if we can find one more, uh, and then we'll uh, we'll call it a we'll talk we'll call it all. <sighs> well, that was kind of a letdown. Not going to lie. Oh, there's. Mm. <sighs> Saucy 2K. That's a nice one. Hey, what's up there, Double A? What's up, man? How are you? Hope you're doing well, man. Good to see you. Hi from Michigan. What's more work in real life? Uh, for one, church job. Uh, I'm a worship leader at church. And also do uh, woodworking here on the side. So I've got a shop and do a lot of custom farm tables, custom woodworking. Um, and then really YouTube and then part stay-at-home dad. So I've got about four part-times to make one full-time life. So that's... that's that's the story of it. So, um, dang it, man! All we got is cement out of here. I don't really want to carry cement. Where's it going? Oh, it's going all the way back to LA. Yeah. <sighs> all right. So I tell you what I'm gonna do. Um, let's just see. I'm gonna see what kind of garages I've got. Um, I don't know if I've got one that's. Yeah, I didn't think I did. Of course I don't. <clears throat> all right. Well, I tell you what. Let's do this. I think that's. Um, Let's call it at that. That's an hour and a half. So, Rakeem S., thank you for your subscription. Appreciate that, guys. Uh, let's call that a stream as it is. That's actually been a really good one. So, let's uh, let's just recap here on the mods for those that are just jumping in here, just joining in a little bit later. Um, let's see. There we go. So, a couple things here on this particular mod. Let's go ahead and uh, we'll cut our engines down. So, a couple things here you want to keep. If you want to look for the stuff on this, uh, tires and wheels are the Alcoa set. Uh, you get that off the workshop. The trailer set is the trailer Yellow Cat. You can find that on the workshop as well. The DLCs, the Heavy Haul DLCs, the Cat Skin you can find off the workshop. And also the uh, the engine, I mean not the engine, but the truck itself is Vipers 389. You can find that on the workshop as well. Uh, which is nice to have those because it does auto update. Now the other thing is the heavy haul chassis. If you just get the truck as it is from Vipers 389, it only comes with the tri-axle in the back. This one uh, actually has a four axle in the back. So it is a quad axle with the uh, with the tag lift there, uh, right there close behind the cab. So this is kind of like your ultimate true, uh, true heavy haul chassis right here. So I, I could imagine what this thing takes to turn but yeah so that, <laughs> so that's what it is that's what we've got engine mod wise um it's the um i couldn't tell you which one it is but i know it's 2.6 it's the caterpillar packar and cummings engine set so if you're looking for it look for the one that says 2.6 you might be able to find it in a workshop if not make sure that one is higher than your sound fix mods if you guys are into the modding uh i just finished uh, just by the way just because this is ats and i need to say this we just finished a four-part tutorial series on uh, my X-Plane flight, go flight stuff, doing some programming stuff. So what I'm going to start working on now is I'm going to get back and I'm going to finish up uh, my mod series. So I'm going to take you through at least how to how to put in ad block, how to activate anything else that you've got through uh, antivirus measures, uh, anything like that. Whoops. Any kind of antivirus measures, anything of that sort. Uh, and that way I could kind of hopefully coach you guys through doing your own modding setups, looking for your own mods, finding out what works, how to troubleshoot different mods that don't work, what happens when it updates and what happens with ATS when things update and what you need to know just kind of, uh, I think right now, I think uh, as of now, my active mod list is up to 53. So 53 mods and that's anything from trucks to skins. I've got about eight trucks in here. I've got uh, three different maps. Um, I was trying to think what else. I've got a few other things. The rest of them are all interior mods. They're all trailer mods. They're all tons and tons and tons of just other stuff. So 53 is what I'm up to now, which is an insane amount. And I don't have any crashes, don't have any problems, just because it's literally taking me this long to kind of figure out exactly what I'm doing. So I'm willing to pass that information on to you guys. Uh, I just need to finish all the mod tutorials. So once we do that, um, we should be good to go. So I'll be looking for that, I would say, at least within the next couple of weeks. I, I've, I've gotten those four done, so now I want to set in and do ET. ATS and ATS respectively, uh, they're both basically the same, but just a little bit, a little bit different. Um, but I think that's going to be perfect for today. Um, that was a really, really, this has been an insane stream. So thanks, guys. Big thumbs up to all you guys for coming in and hanging out. Uh, Nissan, what's up, man? 
Hope you're doing well. So big, let's throw some big shout outs tonight to a couple of our uh, new sponsors. So Incline, uh, my brother from another mother there, he uh, all the way over on the Twitch side of things. He's uh, done some YouTube stuff and come over and uh, it's always great to see him as well in uh, live streams when I saw him on Twitch. So if you are on Twitch, if you like going to Twitch and looking at just all kinds of different kinds of uh, games, jump scare games and stuff, Incline does a lot of them. Uh, just uh, literally type in NC uh or uh nc what is that one yeah here this uh, let's see if i can just copy and paste a lot of uh support there there you go so that's him that's his name um and that's uh that you can find him there so hayden reeves also a big sponsor as well contact him with a sponsor and contact him also ten dollars and through our super chat so awesome to have you guys uh jump along the ride and tons of new subscribers tonight so Thank you, guys. We went up like almost 40 subscribers today, which is insane. So big thumbs up. Uh, and last question here. Um, so how did, did you explain how you chose your name? I did not Dark Sun. So basically, uh, my name came from... Oh, thank you there, Zuma. Um, basically, the name came from... Uh, I was going to go full tilt, like T-I-L-T. -T, and then I realized there was already a full tilt um there was already a full tilt uh name already on youtube so then i decided uh, i went back and looked again and then full tilt you know like the poker uh the full full tilt um god they do the poker stuff they do the they're in all the the mixed martial arts stuff uh big over there in vegas you know all the gambling online gambles and uh, they just kind of marketed the whole entire poker universe and and it became full tilt everything so anyway, um, I went ahead and allowed to go back to Full Tilt. The whole reason that it's Tilled, T-I-L-E-D, is that's because this whole entire channel was based out of Farming Sim, um, and that's kind of where we got our start. So the whole we've been going for just over a year now. Uh, we, we kept up Farming Sim for almost six or seven months, and then we eventually had to move off on some other games. Um, so that's uh, And I'm actually looking, I uh, will say this on chat, uh, we are looking at maybe making a move back on and doing some farm sim stuff just because we got a brand new uh, DLC fix to come up. So that's that's something that I'm 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 actively contemplating. I know some guys just uh, fit, literally fell out in the back of their chairs, um, but uh, but anyway. So yeah, that's where we're thinking about moving back to there. So awesome! Look at their Nissans. That's where he met me on FS17. Uh, absolutely, man. Yeah, that's <laughs> I met a lot of people on there. So uh, yeah, I know we're we're thinking about it. Uh, we're actually actively looking at maps. Um, the thing about the team speak is we're going to have a couple of servers down here as well. So we'll have servers that if you are on PC, if you're on that stuff, you can come uh, and you can be a part of that and uh, actually play on our FTG servers. Uh, we'll have a couple of other things like production map and as well as maybe like a logging map, maybe something that comes in. Um, and we'll have all that active and all that where you can kind of come in here and you can kind of hang out with us. You could do some farming. Uh, and eventually we'll probably work into some some live streams. I will say this though, just and set it up right now. Live streams, at least for right now, multiplayer will probably be reserved for the people that I know. And then as people jump in, as people join in, we get to know you people uh, that do come in. Then we'll look at a, at expanding that as we see fit. But for right now, most of the uh, most of the live stream stuff, if we do multiplayer, will be based out of that. So just just more information, you guys. Uh, you know, it's, it's really hard to just pull in just random people that you have no idea what they're capable of and, you know, how they act, how they interact with. You always like a good chemistry there, uh, and it's hard sometimes in multiplayers to have all that. So um, I want to try to be mindful so that way the entertainment factor for you guys is just as fun as it is driving through ATS or Gold Rush or x or any of the other stuff. So uh, so it's always, yeah, that, it's always that. What's up there? Live from Iraq. Well, tell everybody, Michael, we said, hey, man, that's uh, that's crazy, man. I would assume uh, I would assume military-wise, but maybe not necessarily so. <laughs> he had five foot away in the I know, and we got a big expansion coming in. So GTA 6 win. I, I don't even know when GTA 6 comes out, but <laughs> sure. <laughs> so so anyway, so yeah, so we'll we'll see what all we've got, and we'll see what, how that comes across, uh, and we'll see how those things start kind of you know working their way back in, but. Um, at some way, that's probably we'll run back in and do a little bit of that just because uh, it'd be nice to kind of go back to the roots there and do a little bit of that as we're kind of uh, come across. So, on, oh, awesome there, Michael. Well, 
Yeah, awesome, man. Well, I appreciate the military service there all the way from Iraq. So big salutes there to Mr. Michael there in chat, man. Thank you for what you do. Uh, I appreciate it. I'm sure everybody else here uh, in chat does as well. So that's going to be it for us tonight. I've rambled on and off in our, in our outro long enough. So it's time for me to get the heck out of Dodge here. We'll take the truck and we'll get on and find someone. Uh, I'm not someone. We'll find another trailer here to uh, to go ahead and hook up to and, and pull away here on south. So we'll continue our ATS adventures on sometime this week. We'll go back down and finish our trip up down to uh, to Cabo San Lucas. So that's uh, we're originally where we're going to finish up. So anyway, that's it for me, guys. We'll see you. Remember, life's a journey. Travel it well. Travel it with those uh, that really do enjoy being around you for who you are and not what you can do for them. And by the way, I have to, uh, so we're going to go ahead and make uh, just another, just uh, we're going to add uh, a 3 p.m. there to our, uh, she's always here in the team speak. She's super helpful there as well. And uh, we're going to add her into our moderating team here on our YouTube channel. So congrats there to her. Uh, you others, thank you. Mods, sponsors, you guys are absolutely amazing. So thank you for all for what you do. Uh, and we will, uh, I guess, be back shortly here, probably tomorrow with Gold Rush. And then we'll, uh, at least at some point, we'll run back in and do some ATS. Maybe an ETS, but maybe not this week. We may push that off in some x this week. So lots of stuff going on. Lots of things kind of coming in. So come on and uh, jump on the team suit with us, hang out with us some, and then we'll see you here on the next live stream. All right, everyone, take it easy. We'll see you on the next one, guys.